Good morning and very warm welcome to GeoSmart India this morning. Well, it's a pleasure to welcome you on this occasion. This is a great occasion for geospatial community involving industry, practitioners, policy makers, scientists, academicians, and of course the users. GeoSmart is a rebranded name of India Geospatial Forum, which was known earlier as Map India. So this rebrand is not just for the marketing purpose, but with the purpose to align and connect with the changing and evolving journey of our industry and our community. And this change is very important on this occasion because India as a nation is transforming. India as a nation is growing and perhaps today is the largest and most fastest growing economy in the world. And this also comes at a time when several studies around the world have started pinning to assess the value of geospatial information and technologies across gross domestic products, GDP of several nations. There have been at least dozens of studies being conducted by various market study organizations who have attributed, and I'm not going to debate on the accuracy of those attributes, but that also gives us a trend to have one to three percent of contribution of geospatial information in the economies, depending upon the level of adoption we have, depending upon the level of maturity we have achieved, its contribution in the economy is very varying in that connect. It's also very important to see that the technology which is becoming more and more pervasive, ubiquitous, and helping us in almost every walk of our life is becoming more of a commodity as well. Making the real value of this technology percolating down to the common man. I would like to quote our Prime Minister, Honorable Narendra Modi, who's made a concluding statement about three months before while addressing 1,600 bureaucrats around the country, let there be no space between space and common man. And that's the message which he gave to uh, our community to transform the value of this technology to the common man. With this background, I would like to invite dignitaries on the dais. May I request Dr. Kiran Kumar, Chairman, Indian Space Research Organization, to join us on the dais. Mr. K.K. Singh, Chairman, Rolta Group. <laughs> Mr. Steve Berglund, CEO of Trimble. <laughs> Dr. Mohan Reddy, Chairman of Scient, as well as Chairman of NASCOM. <laughs> Dr. M.P. Narayanan, Chairman of Geospatial Media. Please give them a big round of applause. By very selection of the eminent leaders we have with us today on the dais, 
And we have some very eminent leaders in our audience. I would like to especially welcome Greg Bentley. Can you please stand up and say hello to everybody? CEO of Bentley Systems. We have Dr. Prem Jain, the chairman of AECOM India, as well as the chairman of India Green Bindi Council, Dr. Salesh Nayak, who is the former secretary and currently the president of ISRS. And I'm not seeing some faces, so we have a special guest, Simendra Paul. If I can request him, he is from the US government, heading a very special uh, department helping information sharing environment. Mark Rackett, the president and CEO of uh, OGC. And many more friends. I can go on, and probably I know 50% of you by name. So that's my privilege. We have this very eminent panel of dignitaries today who represent the leadership of this industry, ranging from a professional societies like NASCOM to chairman of Indian Space Research Organization to Dr. Uh, Mr. K.K. Singh, who has been one of the founding uh, pioneers of the geospatial industry in India right from 1982. Dr. Narayanan, who has spent 40 years in the public service as the chairman of various public sector companies, and Steve Bergland, one of the pioneers in the positioning and geospatial industry. So this group brings together a very wide range of perspectives this morning, which makes it very, very suitable uh, for uh, all of us to uh, enlighten uh, and move forward. So before we uh, get into the formal session with the speakers, I would like to also make an announcement that today is a very important day for geospatial media and communications as well. Uh, we have, after a effort of an year or so, we have presented today the India Geospatial Market Report, which talks about how the geospatial fabric in India is expanding and stretching itself into various domains. At the same time, what level of adoption has taken place uh, in these segments and what kind of benefits geospatial technology has been able to come across or contribute into those sectors, and at the same time, what kind of challenges have they faced. I'm very proud to say that this study is based on direct interaction with about 600 plus organizations, as well as a lot of research being done on the secondary level. And uh, I'm sure you'll find it uh, very interesting. May I request the honorable uh, dignitaries to release this report to begin with this session?